Hey everyone and welcome to today's Wix website tutorial. In this video I will show you step by step how to connect MailChimp to your Wix website. So without further ado, let's get right into it. The first thing you want to do is to actually go over to MailChimp.com and now go over to Audience. Then click on Sign up forms and go over to the embedded forms. This will generate a HTML code to embed in your site or blog to collect signups. So simply click on select and you will then be sent over to a site looking similar to this one. Now what you want to do is to go over to form fields and then make sure to fill in everything you'd like on your embedded signup form. For example just the email address, maybe you'd also like a phone number and a first name. You can then go back and go over to settings. Maybe you would like to change the form title, so subscribe now. You can also change the width, so the amount of pixels in width. Yeah, that's pretty self-explanatory. Let's say this is a thousand. And if you'd like to remove CSS styles, you can do that right here. However, I myself won't mess with this if you don't know what you're doing. Now the text, you can leave that alone pretty much. And the same goes for the referral batch. So what you can do now is to click on continue. And you will then see that your form is ready. Copy and paste this code into your website's HTML where you would like the form to appear. So now simply click on copy code and then go back over to the Wix editor. Now you want to scroll down over to the part on your website where you'd like the form to be. And then you want to go over to the add button and go over to embed. Then go over to custom embeds and click on embed a widget. This is what I would like to do. So to click on the plus button. Add to site and here it is. Now you want to drag that to the format you would like it to be. As you guys remember I said 1000 width so the V needs to be 1000 or the W needs to be 1000. So this is the 1000. Now I'm going to make it a little bit larger and click on enter code. This is the most important part so click on enter code and then make sure to copy and paste in the code you just copied. Then click on update and here you will have it. The subscribe now form. And we have connected MailChimp to Wix.com. Now if you do get this bar at the bottom, which obviously you wouldn't want that, make sure to make it even a little bit wider. For whatever reason then it will disappear. And that's basically how to connect MailChimp to your Wix website. 